In the world of Zen philosophy, wisdom is often conveyed through simple yet profound stories. Today, we bring you a timeless Zen tale that explores the concept of openness and the importance of emptying one's cup. This story serves as a reminder that sometimes, to gain new knowledge or insight, we must first let go of our preconceived notions and judgments. Join us as we delve into the empty cup. Once upon a time, in a quiet village nestled between lush green hills, there lived a young scholar named Koji. He was well known for his intelligence and the vast amount of knowledge he had acquired over the years. Koji's head was always filled with facts, theories, and endless thoughts. His mind was like a teacup that was perpetually overflowing. One day, Koji heard about a renowned Zen master, Sensei Haruki, who lived on the outskirts of the village. Sensei Haruki was known for his wisdom and ability to simplify complex matters. People often sought his guidance to attain enlightenment. Intrigued by the prospect of meeting such a master, Koji decided to pay Sensei Haruki a visit. As he approached the Zen master's humble abode, he noticed the beautifully kept garden, the tranquil ambience, and the aura of serenity that surrounded the place. Koji entered Sensei Haruki's small meditation room and found the master sitting quietly, sipping tea from a simple, unadorned cup. The room was adorned with few items, and it exuded a sense of simplicity and clarity. With great respect, Koji introduced himself and began to talk about his vast knowledge, his academic achievements, and the many books he had read. He eagerly awaited Sensei Haruki's admiration and praise. Expecting the Zen master to be impressed by his intellect, Sensei Haruki listened attentively, nodding gently as Koji spoke. When Koji finished, he asked, Sensei, what do you think of my knowledge? Have you ever met someone as learned as I am? Sensei Haruki paused for a moment, his eyes twinkling with kindness, and then responded, Koji, your mind is like this cup. He pointed to the empty cup he had been drinking from. It is already full, to gain the wisdom I can offer, you must first empty your cup. Koji was taken aback by the Zen master's words. He had expected praise, not a seemingly dismissive remark. However, he realized that Sensei Haruki was trying to convey a deeper message. He decided to stay and learn from the master. Over the following weeks, Koji returned to Sensei Haruki's humble abode every day. He sat in meditation, practiced mindfulness, and listened to the master's teachings with an open heart. He gradually began to empty his mind of preconceived notions and judgments. As Koji emptied his cup, he discovered the profound simplicity in the Zen teachings. He learned that true wisdom came not from accumulating knowledge but from being open, humble, and willing to unlearn what he thought he knew. He began to see the world through fresh eyes finding beauty in the ordinary and appreciating the present moment. The empty cup is a Zen tale that emphasizes the significance of openness and the need to let go of preconceived ideas and judgments. The teacup represents the mind, and the act of emptying it is a metaphor for releasing the need to constantly hold on to our existing beliefs and knowledge. In our script, Koji, the young scholar, symbolizes many of us in the modern world who are constantly seeking to acquire more knowledge and recognition. However, we often forget that true wisdom comes from being open to new ideas and experiences, as Sensei Haruki teaches. By visiting Sensei Haruki and gradually emptying his cup, Koji undergoes a transformation. He begins to appreciate the simple things in life and gains a deeper understanding of Zen philosophy. This story reminds us that sometimes, to gain new knowledge or insight, we must first empty our cup, let go of our preconceived notions, and approach life with an open and humble heart. This tale encourages us to practice mindfulness, seek simplicity, and embrace the present moment. It serves as a powerful reminder to approach life with an empty cup, ready to receive the wisdom that unfolds before us.